Are we really alone in this vast universe? Or is there something or someone out there watching us? For centuries, humans have looked up at the night sky and wondered if Earth is the only place where life exists. From strange lights in the sky to powerful telescopes scanning the cosmos, the question keeps coming back. Are aliens real? This isn't just science fiction. It's one of the biggest mysteries of our time. Scientists, governments, and everyday people have searched for answers. But so far, the truth is still just out of reach. And that's what makes the question so powerful. In this journey, we're going to dive into the size of the universe. The evidence we've gathered. The mysteries of UFOs and what science says about the possibility of alien life. By the end, you might not have all the answers, but you'll see why the question itself is one of the most exciting puzzles humanity has ever faced. Let's start with one simple fact. Space is unbelievably huge. When we look up at the night sky, we're only seeing a tiny fraction of what's really out there. Astronomers estimate that our Milky Way galaxy alone has over 100 billion stars. And if just a small percentage of those stars have planets orbiting them, that's billions of potential worlds right here in our own galaxy. Now, here's where it gets even crazier. The Milky Way is just one galaxy. Scientists believe there are at least two trillion galaxies in the observable universe. Each one of those galaxies is packed with stars and planets of its own. When you add it all up, the number of possible planets out there is so massive it's almost impossible for our minds to truly understand. So, what does this mean for alien life? Well, statistically speaking, it feels hard to believe Earth is the only planet with living beings somewhere out there orbiting a distant star. There could be another world with oceans, mountains, and maybe even intelligent creatures looking up at their sky and wondering the same thing we do. Are we alone? But here's the twist. Even though the universe seems full of possibilities, we haven't found direct proof yet. That's the paradox that keeps scientists awake at night. With all those planets and galaxies, why haven't we discovered undeniable evidence of life beyond Earth? This mystery leads us straight into our next chapter, the search for alien signals and the tools humanity uses to try and answer this cosmic question. If aliens are really out there, how do we even begin to find them? For decades, scientists have been pointing massive radio telescopes at the sky hoping to catch a signal, a whisper from another civilization across the stars. This effort is known as SETI, the search for extraterrestrial intelligence. The idea is simple. If intelligent life exists, maybe they're sending out messages, either on purpose or just as background leakage from their technology. There have been some intriguing moments. One of the most famous is the WOW signal. Detected in 1977, a sudden, unexplained radio burst from deep space that lasted just 72 seconds. To this day, no one knows what caused it. Was it interference, a natural phenomenon, or could it have been the first sign of something beyond Earth? 
Modern projects like the Breakthrough Listen initiative are taking this search to a whole new level. Using some of the most powerful telescopes in the world, scientists are scanning millions of stars, listening for patterns that nature can't explain. And with new technology, we're also exploring exoplanets, worlds orbiting other stars, trying to find atmospheres that hint at life. But here's the frustrating part. So far, nothing conclusive. Lots of signals. Lots of noise. But no undeniable hello from out there. It's like tuning into static, waiting for a voice that may never come. Still, the search continues. Because even one confirmed signal would change everything we know about our place in the universe. And while scientists keep listening, the public has been fascinated by another kind of evidence. Strange lights in the sky, mysterious objects, and the stories we call UFOs. While scientists aim their telescopes at the stars, regular people here on Earth have been pointing their eyes at the skies and reporting things they can't explain. For decades, stories of unidentified flying objects or UFOs, now often called UAPs, Unidentified Aerial Phenomena, have captured the public's imagination. Some of these reports are as simple as strange lights darting across the horizon. Others describe metallic disks, glowing orbs, or craft moving in ways that seem to break the laws of physics. From farmers in the 1950s to Navy pilots in the 2000s, the accounts all share one thing. Mystery. The U.S. government has even released declassified footage taken by military pilots. Videos showing objects with no visible engines, performing maneuvers our best aircraft can't match. Are they secret technologies, natural phenomena, or something else entirely? Nobody knows for sure. Skeptics argue that most UFO sightings can be explained by weather balloons, drones, or even optical illusions. And that's probably true for many of them. But what keeps the debate alive are the cases that defy explanation, the ones backed by trained observers, radar data, or multiple witnesses. These stories fuel endless speculation. Could they be visitors from another world? Or are they just reminders of how much we still don't understand about our own skies? One thing's certain. UFOs have blurred the line between science, conspiracy, and culture. And that tension has kept humanity asking the same question. If they're real, what does it mean for us? To dig deeper, we need to look at the balance between science and imagination, and how both have shaped the way we think about aliens. When it comes to aliens, science and imagination often walk hand in hand. On one side, we have the hard data, astronomy, biology, physics, all trying to answer the question of whether life exists beyond Earth. On the other side, we have movies, books, and culture shaping how we picture these beings, from little green men to massive starships. Science tells us that life, at its core, is chemistry. If the right conditions exist, water, energy, and the right elements, then life could potentially emerge. That's why scientists focus so heavily on exoplanets in the habitable zone, places where liquid water might flow. The discovery of microbes, even the tiniest bacteria on another world, would prove that life isn't unique to Earth. But while science works carefully and slowly, our imagination runs wild. Hollywood has given us aliens that are friendly explorers terrifying invaders, 
or mysterious beings beyond comprehension. These stories don't just entertain us. They also influence how we interpret real-world mysteries, like UFOs or strange signals from space. The danger, of course, is letting imagination replace evidence. Jumping to conclusions without proof can lead us down rabbit holes of conspiracy and fear. But imagination also drives curiosity. Many scientists today admit they were inspired by science fiction as kids, which pushed them to explore the universe for real answers. So the truth lies somewhere in between. Science gives us the tools. Imagination gives us the vision. And together, they keep the search alive. But what if one day we actually discover proof? What would it mean for humanity if we finally confirmed that we're not alone? So, are aliens real? The honest truth is, we don't know. But here's what we do know. The universe is unimaginably vast, filled with billions of galaxies, stars, and planets. The odds that Earth is the only place with life feel almost too small to accept. And yet, without hard proof, the question remains wide open. If one day we do find alien life, even something as small as a microbe on another planet, it would change everything. It would mean life isn't unique to Earth and that the universe might be teeming with possibilities. If we discovered intelligent beings, the impact would be even greater. Our view of ourselves, our religions, our science, even our politics would shift overnight. For now, though, the search continues. Scientists keep scanning the skies. Governments keep investigating strange phenomena. And humanity keeps wondering. Maybe the answer is out there, waiting for us to find it. Or maybe it's closer than we think. The mystery is what makes this journey so powerful. Whether you're a believer, a skeptic, or just curious, the question of alien life forces us to look up, to dream bigger, and to realize how small yet connected we are in this vast cosmos. So the next time you stare at the night sky, remember, you're not just looking at stars. You're looking at a universe filled with secrets we haven't unlocked yet. If you enjoyed this exploration of one of humanity's greatest mysteries, don't forget to like this video, subscribe for more space documentaries, and hit the bell so you never miss our next journey into the unknown.